Hi everybody. So this is a Razor scooter and this one's a model E300 and just got done putting two new batteries in it. Uh, so these are the old ones right here and what happened to them was uh, you know they stopped taking a charge uh, but they also started to warp real bad uh, and they're actually bubbling out on the sides and on the bottom. So, you can see some more bubbling on this one, on that side, and on this bottom also. Now, there's a date code on these batteries, 2014-09, so it's September 2019, so it's been five years. And this scooter really hasn't worked much in the last two years, so uh, I guess just from sitting and not being properly charged and not being used, uh, the batteries just went bad. But don't really know why they're puffing out. There must be some chemical reaction that's happening inside and making the material expand. Uh, so anyway, when you go to do this, uh, these wires that connect to the battery uh, are actually soldered connections. Uh, so when you go to desolder it and resolder to the new battery, you're going to have to use a pretty high powered soldering iron because uh, there's just so much material there that if you use a small weak soldering iron, uh, the heat's going to dissipate pretty quickly. So just something to keep in mind. So just something to keep in mind. And these are the new batteries that I got. About 20 bucks a piece, not that bad. And here's the model information on the old batteries that come with the scooter. They actually say Razor on them, so pretty cool. And a pretty simple replacement job, too. Uh, it's only a few screws to take the uh, standing cover off, and then once you get in here, there's really nothing holding it down. This is just kind of wedged in there, kind of sandwiched together. So you can just pick out the old batteries, uh, cut off the shrink sleeve, desolder it, resolder it, put new shrink sleeve on it, and then you're good to go. So pretty easy, pretty cool. Well, if you have any questions or any comments, post them below. And thanks for watching. And if you like my videos, please subscribe.